Right now, we have a B1 English story. It just takes two minutes. And in two minutes, I want you to listen actively because after the story, I will ask you five questions about the story. Let's see how much you can remember. Let's see how much you can remember about this story. Rania's unexpected holiday. Rania the Capybara loved her quiet life by the river. Every day she relaxed in the sun and swam with her friends. But one day something strange happened. A large envelope arrived with her name on it. Inside was a ticket for a luxury cruise. Rania was surpri surprised but excited. She packed her bags and got ready for her holiday. On the cruise ship, everything was perfect. There was delicious food, a swimming pool and lots of fun activities. Rania thought this would be the best holiday ever. But halfway through the trip, something unexpected happened. The ship suddenly stopped moving and the captain made an announcement. They had landed on a mysterious island. All the passengers, including Rania, had to get off the ship and explore. As Rania walked around the island, she noticed something strange. All the animals on the island were capybaras, just like her. It turned out that the whole cruise was planned to bring capybaras together from all around the world for a special reunion. Rania couldn't believe it. She thought she was going on a simple holiday, but it turned out to be an amazing surprise. She met new capybara friends, enjoyed the island and had the best holiday ever. I got five questions for you about the story. That's how the game works. Listen up. Where did Rania live before going on a holiday? That's a tough question. You might already have forgotten because it's so exciting. Where did Rania the Capybara live? Chinese friends. Do, 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 do. The Chinese friends are faster than you guys are. What is this? China against everybody else? In Palestine? No. There was no country. It wasn't a country, guys. Where did Rania live? She didn't live on a mysterious island, no. Rania the Capybara loved her quiet life by the river. Yes, by the river is the only place they mention in the story. It's the only place they mention in the story, by the river. I would love to live by a river. I like rivers, like the one we had when we were in um, when we were in Bali in Denpasar. Remember, that was a nice river. Oh, that was a, such a good room, such a good room. Well done. Question number two. An answer in a sentence. What did Rania find inside the envelopes? or envelopes. I like to say envelopes. What did Rania find inside the envelope? What did she find? Let's go Bali again. I wish, bruh, I wish. A ticket, a ticket for a what? Guys, put it in a sentence. Put it in a sentence. 
She found a ticket for... Well done, Dida! Murphal, I don't know if it's a million dollar ticket, but it was a ticket. She found a ticket for a luxury cruise. For a luxury cruise. Well done! Question number three. What happened to the cruise ship during the trip? What happened to the cruise ship during the trip? Hmm. What happened to the cruise ship? It crashed? Uh, I didn't say crash. No. Alan, exactly. Alan, you are right. The ship suddenly stopped moving. Yes, suddenly. Which means unexpectedly, suddenly. Like, suddenly, unexpectedly, like surprisingly even. Yeah, that's also a synonym for suddenly. Suddenly, you know, as in... <coughs> suddenly, you got scared. Unexpectedly. Did I get you? Did I get you? <laughs> Ah, <laughs> suddenly. All right. <laughs> Question. Oh, YouTube, why is your audio so loud? Question number four. It didn't break down. It didn't break down. It just stopped. It said they had landed on a mysterious island. It didn't say they, it broke down. Because she also, it's just a holiday. I think she also left. Question number four. Who did Rania find on the mysterious island? Who? And it's not an owl. Who did Rania find on the mysterious island? Who? 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 Make a sentence, guys. Put it in a sentence. That's how you speak English. She found. What did she find? Yes. <laughs> it's hard to type capybara, isn't it? <laughs> I know, guys. Rania walked around the island and she noticed something strange. All the animals on the island were capybaras, just like her. Capybara, guys, is C-A-P-Y-B-A-R-A-S. Capybaras. All the animals, so not just one capybara, probably a mountain of capybaras. <laughs> All the animals on the island, it doesn't really state like a lot or a hundred. It just says that all the animals on the island were capybaras. <laughs> Can you imagine a mountain of capybaras? <laughs> you come outside, there's just a mountain of capybaras. <laughs> all right, question number five. Question number five, last question about the story. And I will read the story again. How did Rania feel about the surprise at the end of the story? How did Rania feel about the surprise? Because she found these capybaras and it turned out that the whole thing was, was a plan. The whole cruise was planned to bring capybaras together from around the world for a special reunion. But how did it make Rania feel. Capybara meeting. Sounds like a good meeting. I want to join that meeting. Anybody ever go to a capybara meeting? Invite me. How she felt? Actually hard to say. Because it doesn't really describe it in the story. This is what it says. Rania 
couldn't believe it. So if you couldn't believe it, maybe she felt flustered. She thought she was going on a simple holiday, but it turned out to be an amazing surprise. So she felt surprised. She met new capybara friends, enjoyed the island, so she felt uh, joy and had the best holiday ever. Supercalifragilisticexpialidocious? Yeah, you are supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. How would you feel after the best holiday ever? How would the best holiday ever make you guys feel? Give me, give me a adjective. How would it make you feel? Capybaran? Capybaranas? That sounds dangerous. <laughs> Impart could mean I am imparting my knowledge on you. I am sharing my knowledge with you and you are learning. Excited, happy, sure, joyful. These are great words. You hope you don't dream about many capybaras. Sounds like a good dream to me. Nostalgic, surprised. I see, I see. Yeah, would, would feel the same for me, I think. Yeah. Great story. I liked it. A nice and simple story.